falling ever further behind them. Oh, way out of another big five of Ruiz is down. Good luck, Ted. Welcome to our channel. Today we'll show you the 25 most shocking knockouts in boxing history that people still talk about. Mike Tyson vs. Trevor Burbick, 1986 At just 20 years old, Mike Tyson knocked out Trevor Burbick to become the youngest heavyweight champion in history. This wasn't just a victory, it was a statement of power that stunned the world. Let's see how long his reign lasts. Tyson will be able to get underneath it. Oh, wow! With a right, another left hook that just crazy. He can't take shots like this very long. Wow. WBC heavyweight championship of the world. Trevor Burbick and Mike Tyson. Tyson goes to work right away. And he gets Trevor in trouble. He's the big wow. With that up and down is Tyson. Catches him with a light left hook. And he goes down. As Trevor Burbick falls back in the rope. I don't know if he's going to be able to continue. He's got the hard time at home. It will be scored as a knockout. Mills Lane. George Foreman versus Michael Moore, 1994. At 45 years old, Foreman became the oldest heavyweight champion in history. One perfect right hand sent Michael Moore crashing down, etching George's name forever into boxing's lore. Here in Las Vegas. Michael Moore needs to go back to working. That's it! It's a short right hand! There is no way he's gonna knock Manny Pacquiao versus Ricky Hatton, 2009. Manny Pacquiao knocked out Ricky Hatton in the second round in one of the most devastating finishes of his career. The impact was immediate and Hatton was left motionless on the canvas. They are genuinely friendly. They like each other. His hands are so quick. That's the point. That is so... Oh my God. They're doing the right thing by moving... Thomas Hearns versus Roberto Duran, 1984. Thomas Hearns delivered a crushing right cross that sent the legendary Roberto Duran to the canvas in the second round. This was the moment the world realized Hearns' true destructive power. Mike Tyson vs. Larry Holmes, 1988 This fight marked a pivotal moment when Mike Tyson became the first man to knock out the great Larry Holmes, adding another name to his legendary list of conquests. Julian Jackson vs. Harold Graham, 1990 Known for his knockout power, Julian Jackson lived up to his reputation by knocking out Harold Graham with one of the most brutal punches in middleweight history. But falling ever further behind them. Oh no! That's what we were worried about. That's a real tragedy. Muhammad Ali versus George Foreman, 1974. Rumble in the Jungle, a fight known by everyone. Ali used his legendary rope-a-dope strategy to tire out George Foreman before knocking him out to reclaim his heavyweight title. Sergio Martinez vs. Paul Williams, 2010 Sergio Martinez delivered a picture-perfect left hook that knocked out Paul Williams cold. It's often hailed as one of the most beautiful one-punch KOs in boxing history. Let the ride begin. And to me, he's neutralizing the plane. Lancing left.
Rocky Marciano vs. Jersey Joe Walcott, 1952 Rocky Marciano, one of the toughest fighters of all time, knocked out Jersey Joe Walcott with a monstrous right hand to become the heavyweight champion. Sugar Ray Robinson vs. Gene Fulmer, 1957 Considered one of the greatest knockouts ever, Sugar Ray Robinson landed a perfect left hook that dropped Gene Fulmer to the canvas in spectacular fashion. Juan Manuel Marquez vs. Manny Pacquiao, 2012 in their fourth meeting, Juan Manuel Marquez knocked out Manny Pacquiao with a right hand that left fans in disbelief and cemented their rivalry in boxing history. Tommy Morrison vs. Razor Ruddick, 1995 Tommy Morrison showcased his raw power by knocking out Razor Ruddick in a thrilling heavyweight showdown that had fans on the edge of their seats. Terence Crawford vs. Yuri Orcus Gamboa, Dos Mil Catorce. Terence Crawford displayed his dominance by knocking out Yuri Orcus Gamboa after multiple knockdowns, proving his place among the elite. That changes the equation. There's no quit in Gamboa. He keeps battling, falling forth. Lennox Lewis vs. Hasim Rahman, 2001 Lennox Lewis reclaimed his title by knocking out Hasim Rahman with a vicious right cross, proving that he still reigned supreme in the heavyweight division. Roy Jones Jr. vs. Virgil Hill, 1998 Roy Jones Jr. delivered a body shot that dropped Virgil Hill, making it one of the most memorable body shot KOs in boxing history. Jones lands a left. Now there's... It's Jones' power over Hill's jab. Whoa! Right Arturo Gotti vs. Leonard Doran, 2004 Known for his dramatic fights, Arturo Gatti ended this battle with a brutal body shot, leaving Leonard Doran unable to continue. Zab Judah vs. Kostya Chu, 2001 Kostya Chu shocked Zab Judah with a powerful right cross, ending their fight with a knockout that fans still talk about today. The slightly smaller man, then get complacent Zab Judah here in the second round, the right hand from Chu was good. And Judah, he's up very quickly, but his eyes are in orbit. It's over. He is gone. Beautiful punch, bang on the chin. Of the world, the thunder from Antonio Tarver versus Roy Jones Jr., 2004. Antonio Tarver delivered a stunning knockout to Roy Jones Jr. in the second round, in one of the most shocking moments of Jones's career. He's in the house during the first fight from time to time. Tell the times that Roy would actually go to the rope. So evidently he has a lot of respect for Gaynor. And to his friends. At the end of round one, Tarver stalking now. Sustained attack against him. And down goes Jones. And he makes it up. Deontay Wilder versus Artur Spilka. 2016. 
Deontay Wilder showcased his knockout power by flooring Arthur Spielka with a devastating right hand in the ninth round, leaving him unconscious on the mat. Naoya Inoue versus Nonito Donaire, 2022. Inoue solidified his status as one of boxing's most dangerous fighters, knocking out the legendary Nonito Donaire and adding another KO to his highlight reel. Saul Canelo Alvarez vs. Amir Khan, 2016 Canelo sent Amir Khan crashing to the canvas with a thundering right hook, sealing the deal in the sixth round and putting his power on full display. David Tua vs. John Ruiz, 1996 One of the fastest knockouts ever, David Tua knocked out John Ruiz in just 19 seconds, sending a clear message to the heavyweight division. Listed as having a reach advantage here, we'll see how he uses it. Tua with a big left hook right at him, another big bomb and Ruiz is down! This could almost be over now! Jack Dempsey vs. Luis Firpo, 1923 a legendary fight filled with knockdowns, Jack Dempsey finally finished Luis Firpo with a knockout that left fans in awe of his ferocity. Edwin Valero vs. Antonio DeMarco, 2010 Edwin Valero showed his toughness by knocking out Antonio DeMarco, proving he was one of the sport's most dangerous punchers. Corner that if he didn't get this, going to stop the fight. Nice straight left. I think they underestimated some of the skills of Valero. Retiring on a stool, the champion. Ricardo Lopez versus Alex Sanchez, 1997. Ricardo Lopez capped off a brilliant performance with a crushing right hand that knocked out Alex Sanchez, further cementing his legacy. Junior will take anything in there. There's evidence. He was trying to take an eight count. Right uppercut to the body. Each of these knockouts didn't just make history. They showed that in boxing, a single moment can change everything. Thank you for watching. Hit the like button if you enjoyed this, and don't forget to subscribe for more thrilling boxing stories ahead. Oh!